beautiful thing about the Pabby is that it is absolutely equal. It doesn't matter whether you're a firsts player or a struggling Glamour 11 player. Once you walk through the door, you are equal. So what we used to do, of course, is we'd have one function at the start of the year and then be banned for the rest of the season. <laughs> so the sports union would hand over the keys and, and say, look, um, you can do it, but you've got to be out by 11.30. And we'd say, oh, yeah, we'll be out by 11.30, no problem. And then, you know, the <coughs> security guy would come around at 2.30. Um, we wouldn't clean up. And then, of course, we're banned for the rest of the season. Some fantastic highlights. We used to do, uh, there was the half carrot award, needs no for the description, celebrating into varsities. So we've had a couple of great muck discos here, and yeah, and as you say, it's a, it's a pretty average disco with his uh, 63 blokes and four, four girls. <laughs> Cropo had manned the bar, and uh, Cropo Greens became, of course, the old can of VB. And as soon as he uh, left the building and we could see his car heading off into the distance, it was Cropo's shout. And the next couple of rounds generally were, uh, were on the house. And judging by the takings of the bar <coughs> most nights, it would seem that tradition is uh, still alive and well. Really hot day against Carlton here. Tiger Irvine and Sleepy Hotton were drinking beers and uh, they had the, they taken their shoes and socks off, had their shirts off, sitting in their shorts, and then next time I turn around, there's 25 blokes completely nude, <laughs> sitting, sitting along Nude Row. The beers always taste better on Nude Row. <laughs> there's all these college students walking back to their, <laughs> walking back to their rooms with 25 guys. <laughs> in Cropo Greens in the nude. One highlight, of course, was Daryl Ludwig, the perennial 20-year-old, as he still is today at 50, found a way to squeeze his Ford Escort for an error-free lap, not a scratch to be found. And so, deservedly, now infamous Ludo lap. <laughs> Memorable shotguns would be Hugh Beryl, do it in Spanish, Jorva Jorva, Mr Miyagi in Japanese, <laughs> and then Stevie versus shotgun where there was so much passion he started crying from passion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what are you